So in Ohio in particular, you do need to have insurance anytime you're on the roads. And that's true in most, if not every state in the United States. But not all insurance is necessarily created equal. When you purchase liability insurance, you're purchasing it in the event that you hurt somebody else. But that does not protect you in the event that somebody hits you and they don't have insurance. Well, let me follow up. I have done this for a long time. And I wish that we could put a bubble around our families and protect them. Now, of course, we can't. But there is one thing that we can do. And that is the uninsurance, underinsured aspect of a policy. I'll be short with this because it's kind of boring. But what it does is it creates a bubble of protection for you and your family in the event that one, the other person that hits you has no insurance and you go under your uninsured. Or number two, the one that hits you doesn't have enough insurance for the damages and then you go under the underinsured portions of the policy. And as personal injury attorneys, we've been on both sides of this equation where we've had to explain to families that there is simply no coverage because the person that injured them didn't have adequate insurance. We've also been on the other side where people have been able to avoid bankruptcy and a lot of other horrible things because they had uninsured, underinsured insurance. So we can't underscore this enough. You need to have uninsured, underinsured insurance. So when you go to your agent to get the policy, he, you must tell them and request that coverage. It is not automatic anymore in this, in this state. But you used to tell me that it used to be a requirement that the insurance company would offer that to you, but that's no longer the case. That is true. That happened a few years ago where they changed the requirement under the statute. So what happens is, in the old days, if you got 25000 of liability insurance, it was automatic that you would have then 25000 of uninsured, underinsured. That is no longer true. So you, you must ask. So you have to ask. Remember, you have to ask for uninsured, underinsured coverage. It can save you from bankruptcy.